Hi everyone, how are you doing? Mr Beckson here. Um, as you know, school closed about 10 weeks ago um, because of the coronavirus and we have been seeing some of you coming in because you've either been key worker children or maybe you've had another reason to come in. Well, we're ready to invite some more year groups back now. We're looking forward to seeing children from reception, from year one and from year six back here at St Bart's with us very soon. We've been putting plans in place to make this possible. And when you come back, you are going to notice that some things look slightly different. This video is just to show you some of the people you'll be working with and what the changes look like so that you feel ready to come back and join us. The most important thing that we have had in mind as we've been making our plans is your safety and your happiness. We would really like to encourage you to come to school on foot or by bicycle. Please try to avoid using a car if at all possible. When you arrive at school in the morning and when you're ready to go home, you will be going through the same gate. There are three gates in our school and this is gate one. When your teacher phones you up to let you know which classroom you'll be in, and which days you'll be coming to school, he or she will also let you know which gate, gate one, two or three, you will be coming to school and leaving school from. This is gate two, so you'll arrive in the normal way and start to come up the path, but instead of going up to the front door, you'll make your way to this gate two, which takes you into our early years garden. You'll then enter the school through a year one classroom and you'll be able to leave the school in exactly the same way by coming out of that year one classroom and coming back down here to gate two where you'll be collected by your parent. And this is gate three so we don't normally let you walk on the grass at St Bart's but we've made a very special change. We're going to let you walk on the grass to make your way up through this entrance which is called gate three so that you can go into the school and when you leave via gate three, you will come back down across the grass and meet your parent here. When you come to school, we would like only one parent to bring you in or to come and collect you. And when you arrive, you will need to wait at your gate until your teacher comes down to collect you. Your arrival time will either be 8.30, 8.45 or 9 o'clock and your teachers will be phoning to let you know what your time is. Once you've arrived, we're going to be asking you and your parents, as well as your teachers when they come down to collect you, to ensure that you stay a safe distance of between one and two metres apart from each other. This is what one of our early years classrooms looks like. So as you can see, we've got some toys out and we've got these separate tables, got some counting materials over there, lots of space and the children will be sat in this very new socially distanced way. And here's what another one of the early years rooms looks like. So as you can see, there's still lots of fun things to do and more space for you to do them in. Hello, I'm Mrs Hollier. Hello, I'm Mrs Carr. And we're looking forward to seeing you on Mondays and Tuesdays. We're called Red One. Look forward to seeing you then. Bye. Hello, I'm Mrs Burton. And I'm Miss Cross. And we're Red Two, and we'll be in it on Monday and Tuesday. I can't wait to see you all. Bye. Hello, Blueberries. I hope you are well. It's Miss Daniel here and Mrs Poole. We are really looking forward for you coming back to school on Thursdays and Fridays and this is our new class where we are going to be learning and the name of our class is um, Blue Base One. We would like to show you around and uh, I hope you will enjoy it. 
as we are going to have lots of fun and we really want to hear about all your adventures and all the mischiefs that you've been uh, doing at home and we are really looking forward to um, see you here and come and play with us. Hello, my name is Mrs Taylor. Hi, it's Mrs Rowland here and we are going to be Blue Base 2 and we are very, very excited to welcome you back on Thursdays and Fridays. This is what one of our Year 1 rooms looks like. So as you can see, all of these desks are set up to make social distancing nice and easy. And each desk has its own pack with all the materials in it that you'll need to do your work. It's a nice big spacious room where you can come in and have lots of fun learning and being together but just a little bit further apart than you're used to. Hello I'm Miss Jenna and I'm Mrs Cayley and welcome to Luxembourg Class 1. We're going to be meeting you on Mondays and Tuesdays so I'm looking really forward to seeing you next Monday. Yes me too I'm looking forward to seeing you all again on Monday. Hello everybody my name is Mrs Lynch and I'm Mrs Dooley and I'm really looking forward to, we're really looking forward to welcoming all the children who are going to be in Luxembourg 2, because that is our class, Luxembourg 2. I am so excited to be able to meet you and work with you, because I've seen you in the hall having your lunch, but I don't know you very well, so this is our chance to get to know each other. We're going to come to school on Mondays and Tuesdays, those are our special days, and we're going to have lots of fun. We're going to sing, we're going to learn maths, we're going to do our phonics and reading, we're going to play outside, and maybe even do some art, we're going to have lots of fun. So I'm really looking forward to seeing you. Mrs. Julie? Hello, you may know me from the playground, and you may remember um, when we cooked together, but I am also so excited about working with you year one in Luxembourg too. So can't wait to see you on Mondays and Tuesdays. Sending you lots of love. Hello, I'm Mrs Curry and this is going to be Germany class one and I'm going to be working on a Thursday and Friday with Mrs Coyley and I'm really looking forward to working with year one. Um, it's going to be so exciting, we're just getting your room ready and we can't wait to meet you next week. So looking forward to seeing you next week. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Hello, I'm Mrs Hall and I'm really excited to have some of Germany class back in with me. So we're going to be Germany 2 class and we're going to be together on Thursdays and Fridays. And I'm really excited to have Mrs Sickhand with us. Hi, I'm Mrs Sickhand and welcome to Germany 2 class. Um, looking forward to seeing you and getting to know, know you more and we'll see you on, I will see you on Thursday and Friday. This is what our year six classrooms are going to look like. As you can see once again the desks have all been spaced out so that we've got lots of room to do our work and to stay nice and healthy. We'd like our year six children to bring in their own pencil cases but you will be given these things that you can see on this desk. So there's a whiteboard and a pen, a glue stick. We've got an exercise book that you'll do all your work in, a dictionary, a thesaurus, a tray, and there'll probably be a few other little bits and pieces that the teacher will give out as and when you need them. Hello, I'm Mrs Stanley. This is going to be Australia One and I'm going to be here on Mondays and Tuesdays and I'm really looking forward to seeing you all. Hello everyone, I'm Mr Boller. Welcome to, this is Australia Class 2 and I'm going to be teaching from Monday to Tuesday and I look forward to seeing everyone soon. Hello everyone, lucky children, you with me, you're in Class Fiji One, so Fiji One and you're with me on Thursdays and Fridays and you'll probably recognise the setting you're going to be in our classroom as well. Um, I haven't got much else to say, I'm a man of few words as you know, but hopefully it's going to be sunny so do remember your water bottles, you're allowed to bring in your own pencil case and sun cream and a sun hat would be really useful. Otherwise take care and I will see you on Thursday.
Hello, I'm Mr McKeever. I'm going to be teaching Fiji 2 on Thursdays and Fridays and really looking forward to seeing you all back at Sambalas. Hi guys, yeah. I'm Mr Mob. I'm Mrs Archibald. And I'm Miss Gray. I'm Mrs Moody. I'm Madame Baya. And I'm Mrs Cholton. And we, we are, are the McKeever Group. You might find you're feeling a bit unwell when you're at school and if that happens, don't worry, this is going to be our isolation area, but it's actually just a normal reception area, which you can see through here. We'll be putting in a little plastic chair for you to sit on, and the ladies in the office will be making sure you're okay and phoning a parent to come and collect you so that you can go home and start to feel better. At St Bart's, we're so lucky to have all this outdoor space. Look at this wonderful field that we've got. And don't forget that we have two really sizeable playgrounds. Here's our Key Stage 1 playground. And just over at the back of the shot, you'll remember that there's our Key Stage 2 playground as well. We will be able to sort it so that these outdoor spaces have been divided up, giving every one of our new classes its own outdoor space. We're going to mark these out for you with cones or with spray paint so that it's very clear which space is yours. Then you'll be able to come out and use that space for your learning, to have your lunch and to have some playtime. As you can see it's a lovely bright hot sunny day today and we're rather hoping that the weather's going to stay like this because we want to be outside as often as we possibly can during our time at school together. With that in mind you know that on a hot summer's day we do find ourselves getting more frequently thirsty, so we'd like everybody to bring in their own water bottle, which we can have refilled with new water as often as you need to. We also ask you to bring your own bottle of sun cream to protect your skin from the sun when you're outside. In addition to these two things, if you would like to bring in your own bottle of moisturiser, then that can keep your hands from getting too dry, which is something that will happen not only in the hot weather, but especially with all the extra hand washing that we're doing. And you might like to also bring in your own bottle of hand sanitizer. As you know, washing our hands is vital at the moment, absolutely important to help us to beat this virus. So throughout the day, the teachers will be making sure that you wash your hands regularly for 20 seconds, either at your classroom sink or sometimes at the sinks in our changing rooms with proper hand wash and water, making sure you get right in between your fingers and getting your hands nice and clean. Let's talk about food. First of all, snack times. We know you get very hungry and so do we. So we would like to encourage you to bring in two healthy snacks a day. One that you can have in the middle of the morning and another one that you can have in the middle of the afternoon. We would suggest that together with your bottle of water, you have some kind of fruit, maybe a banana or an apple or something equally healthy and tasty that you can have during these snack times. Now, as for lunchtime, we have organized it so that everybody will have a packed lunch. The packed lunch can either be eaten here in the classroom or your teacher and you might choose that you'd like to go and eat it outside. You may bring your own packed lunch in from school or if you've chosen to have a school dinner then the school kitchen will be cooking for you or preparing should I say a packed lunch which will be delivered to your classroom. We've made some changes to our school's golden rules. The Bart's golden rules. There's still five of them. Let's have a look and see what they say. The first one is to respect people's personal space. And to make that easier to remember, if you can touch someone, you need to take one step back. As I've already mentioned, you will need to wash your hands regularly and you must only use your own equipment. We still expect you, as we always have done, to be kind, gentle and courteous, and of course, to follow adults' instructions at all times. 
Cleaning is going to be absolutely essential. So throughout the day, we will be making sure that some of the places in your classroom are kept thoroughly clean. You might be able to help your teacher with this. So if they come round with a spray and they just spray onto your table, you might be asked just to give it a wipe down. This will also be happening for other things that you touch very often. So maybe your chairs or perhaps the door handles. When you go home, the classrooms will be given a good thorough clean by our cleaners. On Wednesdays, we won't be having any classes in school except for those children whose parents are key workers and they will be in the hall and outdoors. On Wednesdays, this will give us a chance to get our cleaning company in and to give the school a very thorough deep clean. There we are. I hope that you found that video really helpful and uh, interesting as well to see what we've been up to getting the school ready for some of you to come back and join us. I'd like to end by saying again what I started with, which is that we are all one big school community. And if you're not coming back, you are still very much in our thoughts and will always be a part of our school. So we will be providing you with the assemblies online and with the work and the teachers will remain in touch with you. We miss you, we're thinking about you. We're looking forward to seeing some of you very soon and the rest of you as soon as we possibly can. Take care and bye bye for now. Our school is a special place of happiness and joy With life in all its fullness for every girl and boy Jesus is our teacher, he gives us every day His love and understanding to help us on our way We live and learn together and help each other grow we take our learning step by step, sometimes fast and sometimes slow. Our school is a special place of happiness and joy, with life in all its fullness for every girl and boy. The adults and the children are one big family. We all belong together in our school community. Father God in heaven, let us promise you to love the world and everyone the way you want us to. Our school is a special place of happiness and joy, with life in all its fullness for every girl and boy.